Hi, I am Molly Miller, and I'm going to be talking about the astral destiny today. I was just playing in the abyss mode, which is one of my favorite modes. In this mode, there are no other pitches or octaves happening in the reverb. It's just a really large reverb sound that you get. So there's a lot of freedom within that. I had my stretch activated. And when the stretch is on, you get this really cool, lo-fi, warm sound happening. And that's something I really lean towards in my playing. I like warmth in my tone. Another thing that I had happening on this last setting was the rate and the depth we're on. So you get a chorus activated within your sound. And I had my rate on pretty high around three o'clock. And when it's in that zone, you get this really cool warbly effect, which even, you know, leans more in to this lo-fi sound that's happening. So in this mode, you have a lot of freedom happening. You know, you don't have to worry about the pitches that you're playing harmonically as much and be as conscious of it because you don't have to worry about the dissonance that will happen. Where in some of the other modes, you can get a little bit of dissonance, but at the same time, some of that dissonance can be really cool to, to add some tension to what's happening. Mm -hmm. I was just playing in the sub mode, which is my favorite mode. In this mode, you get a really big sound because with your reverb, you're getting an octave lower than everything you're playing. In this last piece, what I was doing was leaning in to this cool thing that happens when you push down on the stretch, whatever the tone is that you're playing will either shoot up or shoot down. And that'll lead to a really cool cinematic, dramatic shimmer. And it's a fun thing to, to lean into. <laughs> I was just playing in the cosmos mode. In this mode, you get a regenerating fifths octave happening in the reverb. So you'll get a beautiful harmony, but at the same time, you have this dissonance that can happen. So it's fun to kind of 
play between the dissonance and the harmony. With the Astral Destiny, I find myself playing in a different way. It's really fun to see how different pedals can bring out different sides of your playing. With the Astral Destiny, I kind of have to slow down and let the pedal work its magic. Mm -hmm. 